This video is brought to you by the School of Social Work AV Team and will review U of M's Zoom security recommendations such as using passcodes and waiting rooms. For the highest level of security, we recommend that Zoom course meetings use a passcode and a waiting room. With these settings in place, authorized U of M Zoom accounts will be placed directly in your meeting, while outside guests will be placed in a waiting room. This is an effective way to prevent Zoom bombing and disruptions to your course, while allowing you the flexibility to invite outside guest speakers to join your meeting when needed. To start off with, sign into your Zoom web portal at umich.zoom.us using your U of M credentials. Go to Settings, and then Security. Check that Waiting Room is enabled, and then click Edit Options. For who should go into the waiting room, select users who are not in your account and not a part of the allowed domains, and then type in umich.edu. For who can admit participants from the waiting room, select host, co-host, and anyone who bypassed the waiting room, then click continue. Note, all users who are not logged into U of M Zoom will be placed in the waiting room. To review this process, please watch our sign-in procedure video, which will be linked in this video and below in the description. Now let's verify that your meeting passcode and waiting room is enabled when you create a meeting. To create a meeting with these security features, create a meeting as you normally would, which we recommend should be done through Canvas. If you are not using the Canvas Zoom integration, we recommend that you do so. Otherwise, you will need to provide the passcode to all of your students. Ensure that the waiting room box is checked off and that there is a numerical code under passcode. Create one if needed. Finally, once the meeting has started, the host will receive a notification whenever someone has entered the waiting room. Click Admit to allow the participant to join immediately or click See Waiting Room to manage the participants. You can see waiting room participants at any time by clicking on the Manage Participants icon. After clicking Admit, the participant will join the meeting. Once a participant has entered the meeting, they can be placed back into the waiting room. To do this, navigate to Manage Participant, find the user you wish to send back, and click the More button next to their name. Then, click Put in Waiting Room. If you do not want to use the waiting room, at minimum, you should use a passcode for your meeting. Please keep in mind that participants may intentionally or unintentionally share this passcode with a wider audience. This can, and has, led to meetings being Zoom bombed. For additional information, or if you have questions, please contact us.